So here is Richard Ely, the man who had the difficult decision to make just before six o'clock that this game should go ahead. Uh, Western all in white and, and Thomas deep inside his own half has got to try and clear but he's got pressure and Max Harris is out of his goal here and Woking have pinched one they have scored not good defending from Western at all and Reese Brown spotted the poor back pass Harris was out of position and it was a fairly simple side foot for Brown into the far corner. Also holding the left hand touch line. Nice run and a nice run and a good shot too on the half turn from Reese Brown down through an inside right channel. And he's going to take the corner as well. Will he play it short? No, he'll clip it right into the heart of the area and it's headed over his own bar by Oyeliki. Hammond just looking along the line to check everybody is marked up flicked in by Grubb and the header from Thomas is over the bar and back to the right once more Western funnel across not the best ball forward from Wilkinson and then possession lost and Ammon could be playing Reese Brown in again here and he's got the second Reese Brown with the second goal just one errant pass pounced on by Porrig Ammond a ball into Reese Brown inside right channel and a low finish past Max Harris and Woking now have control of this. We've got uh, 11 minutes to go to half time and it's Western nil Woking 2. Foyline Morton nods it to Grubb on the Western left. Bastin infield to Morton. Jagger Kane oh, finds Bastin into the area. Bounce chance for Bastin and a good stop from Jaskalainen with his right foot. I'll give you the two benches as well. Might become relevant in this second half. But working at the moment, heading to another of their National League counterparts in the fourth round. But here are Weston on a break. Mannings trying to get trying to get at and into the net with a low shot. Trying to get at Casey. Not only got at him, he beat him and he drove it in to Jaskalainen's left an immediate response from Weston at the start of the second half a goal for Rex Mannings and it's Weston 1 Woking 2 the one real good chance he had saved they needed to make capital out of Mannings' break good work on the right Dan lost it well there had two men in front of him a driving run on the right here by Kahneman gets the ball infield and the shot tipped over the bar on the run Good effort it was too. Max Harris had to make the save. Here is Oyeliki's corner. Oh, and it's a tremendous save from Harris. I think again. I think that was Amund with a header. Looked to be all the world going in. Harris parried it, parried it away, and he got help from his defence. Trot away. Think about a short one. They do play it short to Morton. Morton wants a handball there. Referee's not interested and Woken could break here. Osu's tried to drag the Western defence out of shape. There's a runner on the right. Gets to the edge of the area. Shot fired in. Parried by Max Harris. Kellerman who was with the shot. And there's a, a offside against Osu, I think. But that's just the sort of ball Woking wants. Must watch the ball in his shirt. Four ahead of him in gold, one of which is Ammon in a decent post crossing position and Osu didn't quite reach it the shot comes back in a second time and a very good save by Harris at the near post that side so it's an inside left channel Casey and Ammon over the ball Ammon goes over the wall and off the post Harris didn't get a touch that might have been three inches from sealing the game nearly he didn't do it though Thomas on the right gets over halfway. Jagger King wants the ball played to an inside right channel. He goes and said to Edwards right on the flank. Morton thinks about a low shot and Jaskalainen and gets behind it. It was probably worth a dip from there because there wasn't much ahead of him. Quite a lot of bodies committed upfield here, so Morton might be able to create something, but not with a pass like that, which Moss intercepts. And then possession again given away. We've got seven minutes to go. Certainly Weston haven't given up on this. 
They need a goal to take it to penalties. Edwards. Reed is going on an overlapping run. Reed by the byline. Can he cut the ball back? He can. And it's deflected in. Off grub. Akinola wasn't quick enough. And Grubb has seen his shot deflected in past Jaskalainen. And we're six minutes from penalties. It's Western 2, Woking 2. In this FA Trophy third round tie, we're on the cusp of penalties unless somebody can find a goal. Free kick whipped into the Western box. Lots of bodies coming in on it. Asu, can he get a shooting chance away? He can, he just fires it over the top.